This is me on my trip to a California mission. The mission I visited was Mission Basilica San Diego de Alcalá. Junipero Serra started the mission in 1769. He started the mission in San Diego. There were three pugilists named Junipero Serra, Juan Riscuño, and Fernando who built a cross and blessed it. That is how the mission started. The Indians lived in San Diego or were called Kumaye. Padre Seda built the mission because he wanted the Kumaye Indians to, come, to become Christians. Now the mission is one of the most popular places to visit in San Diego. They still have Catholic church service every day at the mission. Last, it is a cultural center for people of all religions. The church was built in 1775. The church was made of lots of wood and brick. The person who made it was Junipero Serra. The church was the very first church in California. There are priests buried there. The color of the church is white. The doors were made of big red wood. The church was very dark. It was big inside. A guitar, drums, and organ were on the second floor. There was a rope up front by the altar. The church band sits on the second story. They play during church service. The instruments that I saw were drums, a guitar, and an organ. The pulpit is used for reading the Bible. The pulpit is also used by the priest to give the sermon. The designs on the pulpit are from Europe. The pineapple represents welcome. Shell designs were made of minerals. The pews that the people sit in have places to kneel during the service. The pews are made out of wood and cushion on the seat. The church also has a pew for the handicap. The altar is where the priest stands during service. People have communion at the altar. The altar is made out of wood. The designs that are on the altar are from Europe. The table on the altar is a simple wood table. The cross is used for praying and asking Jesus for things. The cross has Jesus on it, showing how he died. Every church has a cross so that it reminds people how Jesus died. The bells rang at 12 o'clock when we were there. The bell on the lower right is named Immaculate Mary. It weighs 805 pounds, and it was made in 1802. The bell on the lower left is named Our Lady of Sorrows. It weighs 1,200 pounds, and it was made in 1894. The garden has plants, statues, a wishing well, and crosses. The garden is in the middle of the mission. The garden has plants called palm trees, aloe, vera, and roses. The crosses stand for the Indians who died. The garden had statues of St. Joseph and Padre Junipero Serra. 
The wishing well has the stature of St. Francis. St. Francis was the founder of the Franciscan order. St. Francis cared about sick people, nature, he fixed abandoned churches, and he taught people how to be Christian. The statue of Junipero Serra is in the garden. Junipero Serra became a priest in 1738 in Spain. Junipero Serra started the Mission San Diego on July 16, 1769. Junipero Serra started many missions in California and Mission Basilica San Diego was the first one that he started. At Mission San Diego, there is no cemetery, but there is a grave in the church. The person who is buried in the church is Padre Luis Jaime. There were five priests who died during their service in the mission. They died in different years. There are, there are adobe bricks and burnt tile crosses in the garden for the Indians who died. The Padres found a spring and a brook to get water, and that is how they got water. They also got water from the San Diego River. They made a new water system in 1798. It was the first water system in the West. They made the water system bigger after 1803 because they weren't getting enough water. The flume was part of the water system. The flume was made of clay and adobe. The chapel was built in 1977. The chapel has choir stalls. The altar in the chapel came from a monastery in Spain. The seats raise up so that the friars can stand in peace while they sing. When they moved the mission in 1774, the Padres built a church and 13 buildings for Indians to live. There was also a girls' dormitory. The building was on the west side of the church. They also had huts made out of sticks and straw, and some huts made out of wood and clay. Last, the huts were all around the mission. The Indians attacked the mission at 1.30 a.m. 
on November 4, 1775. The Pazis built big walls so Indians could not jump over and attack again. They were protected by adobe walls. The walls are three feet thick. The mission was put into a square so that everyone could be safe and because it had to be protected. At the mission, they used to have orchards. Now there is not any more. Indians have classes to learn how to farm. The people who taught the classes were the padres. Some of the food they grew were barley, corn, and beans. They had vineyards and grew grapes and wine grapes. They also had cattle, horses, and sheep. The mission had 50,000 acres of orchards and fields. The parking lot today is what used to be the field and orchards. The Padres room was built in 1774 because it was a new mission. The room was made out of adobe brick and wood. The floor was made out of adobe brick. What was inside was a bed, a desk, and a praying station. Most of the furniture was made out of wood and was plain. The bed was made out of wood and cloth. The Padres made the wood frames that were used to be to make adobe bricks. Adobe bricks were used to build the mission and the walls that protected the people who lived at the mission. Adobe is made out of straw or grass, water, soil, and manure. All of it was mixed and put into wood frames. They had to dry for 90 days, and then the bricks were, were done. The bed is in the Pazes rooms. The Pazes slept on that bed. The bed is made out of dark wood and cloth. It is not like my bed because it doesn't have a mattress. It does not look comfortable to me. The desk has two candles on it. They did not have light bulbs in the Pazes rooms, so they use candles for light. The desk is made out of wood. I think they would write in their journal on the desk. This is Benjamin Gage at the Mission Basilica San Diego de Alcala. I hope you liked it. Thanks for watching.